Good morning, Curly Sue. Come on, we need to go. Curly her. Let's go. Right, come on, you. How do you get? Let's go. School time. Let's roll. Here we get. Ah, there we go. Lift that rubbish for me from the bin, please. Everyone out. Are you chucking me out of my own house? Everyone eat. You chucking me out of my own house this morning? Yes. Eve. Hurry up, Ben. Good you lad. Are you chucking me out of my own house? Uh, really? Ah, you're funny, aren't you? Oh, chuck me out. Could you give me the keys? So you kick me out of my house, then you walk away and leave me standing on my own. Well, we need to rush. We <laughs> oh dear. What are you like? Huh? What? I said, what are you like? And oh, Curly Sue. Curly Sue bank. and the Grumpy Bum over there. So I say, Grumpy Bum there. Here, Lewis. Oh. I have a wee clip to show everybody this morning. Oh. Of you four years ago today, helping your dad make dinner. Should we show the clip, Brooke? You always like me doing flashbacks on him, don't you? What's that? No, because I'm in it, don't. You're not, it's just a clip of him. Oh. Ah, you see? Right, here we go, guys. This is four years ago, Lewis helping his dad make trailer park lasagna. Check out the clip. I think Lewis is on the skive here, so he is. He was supposed to be helping me, now he's in watching WWE Network. <laughs> the pass is cooking. Well, you watch some WWE Network, Aaron. I'll give you a shout when I need you again. Why are you playing 2013 Raw? <laughs> Put on 2016. Five? Why five? Okay. We'll enjoy. Well, Lewis is helping cut up all the meat. Yep. <coughs> because he decided to help. Excuse me. Yep, I walked in this took All the sausage meat and all the ham has been cut up. And all your meats are being added to it soon. So this is giving me a hand here just a little. So, happy days. Good lad. I have more as well as make all the dinner. Aye. Right. You master chef now, you new Gordon Ramsay? Yeah. Yeah, you wish. The kids are now off to school. Hope you enjoyed that footage from four years ago. I can't believe that was four years ago. He's grew up so much since then, so he has his wee squeaky voice and all he had back then. And his wee glasses. Morning. <laughs> uh, so yes, Kevin and Mum and Dad's here now for a little bit. I haven't seen them since it was locked up for a week. <laughs> Um, she's having problems with her sky wire in her bedroom, her sky box in her bedroom, so I think she's going to fix that for her this morning when I'm around here, so it's just a muggy eye morning, look at this guys, look I'm going to focus on the sky there, it's a muggy eye morning so it is, so but I haven't seen mum and dad for, god, I'd say about 10 days so I'm um, so oh, I'm not sure if dad can take us to the airport this Friday, or Thursday, sorry for the football Oh, hopefully Tony's around here getting his morning coffee because I haven't seen Tony in about two weeks. So, but, yes, it's a muggy morning here in Bangor. I had to put my big football coat back on again, guys. So, I had to throw my our big coat into the wash. Oh, so I'm wearing this football coat again. I feel like I'm wearing it every day now. <laughs> um, but yeah, kids are off the school. I can't believe Lewis screwed up so much in the last four years. Scary Becky, so it is on the top of the screen again. Look, we're out there trying to fix the camera here and trying to adjust the camera with the, the sky behind me. But, um, yeah, how much he's grew up in the last four years, it's unreal compared to now. He's grown the right wee man. So is Brooke. She's 16 now, as you all know, so scary bickies. In fact, they've grew up so much then. Maybe in another couple of years, Brooke will be gone, living in her room. So I'll be me and Lewis left. <laughs> so. But no more babies. Definitely not. People ask me all the time, would you ever have another child sometime? Guys, I'm 40 now. So I am, so I spent the last 16 years bringing up two kids. So I have, so most of it on my own. <laughs> but hey ho, anyway, every mum and dad's here, so we'll see when we get around there. Well, things you gotta do for mum. The skybox fixed. Don't know what's wrong with this guy. I have to wait and check the LMB here as well to make sure it's connected up properly. Or there could be a problem with the cable. So let's go and take a look. Just disconnected the box, cleaned it, and give it a rewire. Reconnected all the sky again. So let's see if it works. Fingers crossed. No joy. Now I gotta check the LMBs to see if there's any issues with them. Let's have a look here. Well, I found the problem. 
As soon as I touched this one here, it fell out of my hand. It was loose. So now I need to get a spanner to untighten this to get the cable back up inside there again. So it is, because that's the main living room. That's for the spare room, and that's for mum and dad's room. So there's the problem right there. Oh, here we go. Joys. This is actually embroidered right into the actual LMB, so I'm gonna have to switch one of the cables around to this one, which is a nightmare. So I'm gonna try and get this off with some WD-40 and a spanner, <laughs> try and get it off, but I have to switch the cables around to get the feedback in the mum and dad room. Just waiting for this box to come on then, see if it's gonna work. I had to change the whole connection all I'd say, which was a nightmare. Nope, gotta go back outside again. It says once again, no satellite signal, gotta go back out again. Ta-da! All fixed. Happy days. There we are. Hold on. Just had to tape this one back for a while and cover it all up. Make it secure for the weather. Because this is actually embedded in. So when you get some WD-40 now, go home and get some WD-40, come back later. Spray it and get it all taken off and then replace it with a new one to replace that dirt cable as well. So, productive day. Sky TV all fixed. Just back in from mum and dad's there. And the sky dish is officially fixed. And they're all happy. <laughs> so we are. So, yes, it's been a productive afternoon at mum and dad's house. Now I got more stuff to do when I get home in relation to myself. Now, guys, I started doing some recording there when I come in the door for tomorrow's vlog. Um, because a special item has just arrived in the post for Lewis. So we say a late Christmas present, should we say? I'll show you the footage in that in the next vlog. So I'm home and I've no more things to do. I've more things to do now for myself. Work related and obviously around the house and all too as well. And then I gotta what do you call it, get ready for an hour busy day tomorrow as well. It's just gonna be chock a block tomorrow. So anyway guys, camera's shaking with there. apologies about that. <laughs> so I have to get one of these vlogging things to carry this phone around sometimes when I'm vlogging. But anyway guys, I want to bring this to vlog to an end. Thank you for watching. Should you be quick flashback from Lewis from, uh, was it four years ago today? And also doing a bit of work from on Sky TV dish as well, which is a productive afternoon, should we say. Anyway, if you enjoyed this vlog, uh, stay tuned for the next vlog where Lewis gets a special late Christmas present. He'll be a very happy boy. Trust me, he will be when he sees what's arrived in the post. If you enjoyed this vlog, guys, as always, drop a like this video, also subscribe below. Don't forget to get all your merchandise and more on moorarmy.co.uk. We can check out all social media photographs, check out every video we've ever created on this channel. Hit this channel and Redmond Football Ventures and more, moorarmy.co.uk. Till the next one, guys. Hope you're all having a great day out there. I've had a very productive day today. See you on the next one. Thanks for watching, guys.